Twins looking to sweep a two-game series in Detroit. Doug Fister on the hill for the Detroit Tigers on this day. First inning in trouble. Bases loaded two down. Trevor Plouffe to third. Miguel Cabrera, not a great throw, but Prince Fielder. Nice little pick over there, and Fister gets out of a bases loaded jam. In the third inning, he's not as lucky. One on, two down for Justin Morneau, who goes opposite field for his fifth home run of the season, a laser two-run shot. So second game back for the disabled list for Morneau. He's showing some pop, 2 nothing Twins. Next up, it's Trevor Plouffe. Plouffe drives it to left. There goes another one. Three to nothing Twins. It's his third home run of the year. And back-to-back -back home runs of here in the third inning have given the Twins a 3-0 lead. Fister gives up four runs, three earned in six innings. Now 4-1 in the bottom of the sixth inning. P.J. Walters making his second start of the season. He had cruised early, but Andy Dirks here with his fourth home run of the season, a solo shot that makes it 4-2. One out later, here's Prince Fielder, and he's going to do some damage as well. Fielder with his sixth home run of the season. Walters gives up three runs in six and a third. Bottom eight, Glenn Perkins on. Two on, nobody out, facing fielder. He gets the strikeout, 96 miles per hour from Perkins. Then next batter, it's Delman Young. Grounder to second. It's Casilla to Dozier. Double play, and Perkins pitches out of the jam. There's another double play for the Twins. To the ninth inning we go. Matt Capps looking to close things out. Johnny Peralta at the dish, and Peralta, a hot shot, but... Right at shortstop, Brian Dozier makes the play. And Matt Capps earns the save. It's only the second time this year the Twins have won back-to-back -back games, and they pull off the sweep. Matt Capps earns his eighth save. Walters, his first big league win since 2010.